Hello there. Now there are ice and snow warnings in force through today into tomorrow. The cold air is still upon us. Let's have a look at the bigger picture. Well, over the next few days, a succession of weather fronts will move in from the Atlantic, bringing with it some milder air, but the cold air will always win. And as the rain hits the cold air, always the chance of some snow, particularly over higher ground. Through Thursday into Friday, you can see a cold wind blasting in from the northwest, hence of a fairly severe frost. Then some wet and windy weather on a Saturday, but the cold air will return through the latter part of the weekend. For the time being, we do have a weather front across England and Wales, bringing with it more cloud as well as some rain sleet and a little bit of snow in places. Brighter skies towards the north, some snow showers here, also the risk of hail as well as thunder. Hanging on to more cloud down towards the southeast and temperature struggling wherever you are, two or three degrees Celsius. Now through this evening and overnight, this area of cloud, rain, sleet and snow will pep up and as it hits the cold air, as temperatures plummet, it's likely to turn to snow showers. So we could actually see one to four centimetres of snow across Norfolk as well as Suffolk, clipping London as well as Kent later on in the night. So there is a snow and ice warning in force here, but pretty much anywhere through this evening and overnight, likely to see ice as temperatures plummet and also the risk of snow showers across the north and the west and those showers clipping the western side of Wales as well as the west country. You can see all these blues though representing a fairly severe frost. Temperatures dipping as low as minus two, minus three degrees Celsius. But in the countryside, under starry skies, temperatures could actually dip as low as minus six. So it's a bitterly cold start to the middle part of the week with the risk of frost as well as ice. It's worth wrapping up warm and spending more time on your journey because it's going to be very slippery as well. First thing tomorrow morning then, we can pick up on this weak weather front, again bringing with it some snow showers first of all. And then we can see this cloud and rain moving in across Scotland as well as Northern Ireland. The wind picks up some strength here. And then further south, some sunshine, a dry afternoon to come. We could see some hill snow where that rain hits the cold air, then turning a bit milder across the far northwest of Scotland later with that keen breeze. But generally speaking, temperatures again, two, three or four degrees Celsius. So all in all, another colder day on the cards. But why don't you tell us what's happening with the weather where you are? Hashtag three word weather. Send three words describing the weather, adding your location, tweet us or send us a message on Facebook. Bye bye.